horror fans, once again, it's the Horror Mizamani G, and today I'm doing what I hope to be doing once a month, is doing a uh, horror blog, uh, you know, talking about what's going on in the world of horror, what I think, what's happening in the world of horror as far as movies, horror TV shows, uh, the state of uh, horror as a uh, media form, an entertainment form, and uh, today I was going to talk about something else, but of course, two days ago, what I discovered on BloodyDisgusting.com was that there's going to be a Buffy the Vampire Slayer reboot soon. No, I have to talk about that. <laughs> so here I go. Let's talk about the Buffy reboot. Now, uh, I think Deadline, not the yeah, Dead uh, Deadline. I think they're the first one that break, break, broke the story. Uh, it was eventually uh, confirmed, and I believe uh, Joss Whedon, who was the executive producer and creator of Buffy the Vampire Slayer, uh, released a statement, and it states that, um, I got this from CNN, so this is what I'm reading right now, the article that I read on CNN, it says, Buffy Lives, the supernatural drama Buffy the Vampire Slayer, will be getting a reboot with an Afro-American actress in the lead role, a Fox 21 television studio spokesman confirmed on CNN. Interesting. Uh, like our world, it will be richly diverse, and like the original, some aspects of the series could be seen as a metaphor for issue facing all of us today. Producers on the project told Deadline, uh, which first reported the news of the Buffy reboot. Based on the 1992 film with the same name, Buffy the Vampire Slayer originally ran from 1996 to 2003 on the WB and then later UPN. Sarah Michelle Gellar starred in a title role as Buffy Summers. No actors have been cast on the series reboot yet. Uh, the new showrunner, Monica Owensi Green, I probably screwed that one up, <laughs> has signed on to oversee the project. Director Josh Sweden, who created the original series, will return as executive producer. Uh, let's see. In addition, Gellar, the Buffy the Vampire Slayer, catapulted the careers of actors David Borenz. Allison Hannigan, Charisma Carpenter, Nicholas Brendan, James Marston, and Anthony Stewart Head. It is unclear if any of the original cast members will be part of the new project. And that's basically what the article read in CNN. So it's pretty interesting that this is going to be a diverse cast. We're going to have an Afro-American as a lead, which I find quite interesting. And it's going to be a diverse cast. Now, most people who do know me know uh, about my feeling about reboots, <laughs> remakes, and reimagining uh, uh, shows, uh, first of all, they're going to happen, whether we like it or not. It's the way Hollywood is right now. They're going to remake TV shows, just like they re remake TV shows, uh, the TV shows I grew up with, like Hawaii Five-O. They remake that. They remake SWAT, you know, and they're right now doing the Charm reboot, which I thought was fascinating, because I initially said to other people, whether it was on Killflex or even on some of the live streams that I've done, was that if the Charm reboot was to be successful, they're going to reboot Buffy, because it's going to happen. Uh, little did I know that it was already in the works, and now they're doing it right now. It's just the way Hollywood does things right now. Things get remade, you know, whether it's TV shows or horror movies. I know some people do not like it and don't want their shows to be um, rebooted, but it's just the way Hollywood is right now. I told people this is going to happen, whether we liked it or not. Now, I myself, you know, I'm a huge Buffy fan, just like anybody else. I enjoyed the, the series uh, that it was, because I thought it was an interesting take on how they um, had a female actor be a badass. And that's what it is. And she still suffered some of the uh, same uh, issues that teenage girls suffered uh, uh, during the show. I like the, um, the Scoobies, as they were called, the Scooby Gang. I like all the... Um, cast members. I like some of the villains that they fought. Some of them were a bit silly and over the top, but I did like the entire show. Now, at this point right now, we don't know who is going to be the lead actress. Uh, all we know is that the uh, female lead will be an African-American woman. Uh, I don't know who they're going to cast, but it'd be interesting to see uh, who they would like to cast. And one of the questions I'm going to leave you guys to let the, you know when we have this discussions, who would you like to be uh, uh, the lead actress for this new Buffy. Uh, you know, who would you like to see cast as the original Buffy? I, I, nothing really comes to mind right now because we're still in the early stages right now. But, you know, just leave a question down below. One of the questions I would like to ask my uh, horror fans is who would you like to see cast as Buffy Summers? 
And also, who would you like to see uh, cast as the uh, other cast members of the show? Will they actually have the same names, or will it be all totally different names other than Buffy? I mean, obviously, one's going to be Buffy Summers, but they might actually change her name. They might call her something else. <laughs> Buffy something. Uh, but uh, hopefully, hope, the only thing I will say is that uh, with the uh, success of Black Lightning, which I thought was a very fascinating show, which actually proves that you can actually have uh, African American cast uh, perform well, even on a superhero show, uh, I believe hopefully that they will have the same success. Being that if the show is written very well and the uh, actresses is very good, then you can actually have a successful reboot of a show. I mean, hey, look, Battlestar Galactica, that show did very well. Uh, as well too. So as long as you have a great cast, you have good writing, and the stories are interesting, and I think the show can be successful. So to keep this short and sweet, I will ask you, my horror fans, the next question is, what do you think about the reboot of Buffy the Vampire Clear? Do you think this was a good idea? Uh, do you just hate it once again? Uh, do you have any ideas of what you, who you like to have cast as Buffy or any other cast members? Or if you were going to reboot Buffy, how would you like to uh, reboot the show? Well, I'll leave your comments down in your comment section. Tell me what you think about the Buffy reboot. Well, all our fans, that's my video for today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, please give it a thumbs up because it does help the channel out a lot. And uh, once again, this is your first time here. Please hit that subscribe button and definitely ring that notification bell. That way you can come and enjoy the horror experience with me, the horror, my money, G. And as always... All my social media links will be down in the description box below as well. Once again, my name is Lamont Smith, better known as the Horror Miser Money G. And always remember, horror rules. <laughs> uh, yep, yeah, it's happening. They're rebooting Buffy. Don't you? Children's coming for